Hi, my name is Tara Loftus and I'm with Busy Mommy Media and this is the new Graco Smart Seat that is a that can be used as a convertible seat, forward rear facing, and then as a booster. The Graco Smart Seat is a unique design that um, actually has a stay in the car base, which is similar to that of an infant seat. And the smart seat also comes with a built-in lock-off, which makes installation with the vehicle seat belt, for most vehicle seat belts, much easier. It also can be installed with latch. You can feed the seat belt through the seat face and connect the seat belt, tighten it, and then lock the built-in lock-off. And once, you've established, and once you've installed it with less than an inch of movement, um, then your base is installed. Install the seat in the base, just slide the seat on top of the base, and then lock the seat into the base with the knobs. The smart seat can also recline, which makes it more comfortable for forward-facing passengers to sleep, and it can be used this way up until 40 pounds. The Graco Smart Seat has red tabs that stick up in the bottom of the seat to let parents know that the seat is not securely installed in the base. And to make sure that the seat is secured uh, tightly in the base, you turn the knobs, make sure that those tabs are down, and then check the two windows here on each side to make sure that they've switched from yellow to gray. So if the tabs are down, and these are gray, then you know that the seat is connected securely to the base. For rear facing, you must also adjust the recline until the level is in the middle of the green zone. The Graco Smart Seat is a great seat for families that transport uh, carpools, or for other maybe child care providers like grandparents or um, child cares because you can just switch it back and forth between front and rear facing so easily. Also, there, it has a no thread harness which means you don't have to re-thread the harness every time you're switching to a child with a different height. It's just adjusted with the, the knob up on the top of the seat. One downside of the Graco Smart Seat is that it is a very large seat and it takes up a lot of space uh, front to back. So you need a car that has a lot of space between the back and the front seats, even when it's uh, forward facing as well. Um, the other downside that I see with the seat is that the shoulder pads are very thick and are required at this time by Graco up until 40 pounds, which is the rear facing limit of the seat. And since they're so thick, they might be uncomfortable for some children and especially newborns. The Graco Smart Seat is available right now through Babies R Us and is available in a gender neutral and in a female cover choice.